deleted all the footage from yesterday. Not all of the footage. Okay. A, a huge chunk of it, at least. So let's do a run through of everything that you are actually not going to see. So I finished up these four guys yesterday. Um, some of them still need coats of sealer on them. These two already have a coat. These two don't. These are not my best eagles, I will say that. I am working on eagles and I haven't mastered that yet. My berries on the other hand, I really like them and they're super cute. I found my style, I'm happy with them. But these guys, still working on them. And then in the middle of that, Ben and I went on a four wheeler ride. So then on the four wheeler ride, we found this tree. On the top of it, we found down there. Somewhere down there. Because the top fell off. Look at all the soybeans. We're so happy that they planted soybeans and not corn. No, no offense to our neighbors, we love them. But it kind of takes away our beautiful view that we have when they plant corn. So we are walking down to um, where the white pine was. So the white pine was Hopefully there's no snake or something. The white pine was down over here, like right in there. The other half of the tree is like right there. It was honestly a pretty good spot because we were able to get to that tree from the road with the tractor. So that's what we did. We grabbed it with some big old straps and we pulled it as far as we could, and then to get away from all this jungle mess, because it's very overgrown. And I went back, grabbed the saw, because we didn't grab a saw. So I grabbed a saw, I believed I grabbed the MS-171, and I chopped away all these branches. So we just kind of left them here. We, sh we probably should clean up a little bit. Then, after I cut down all the branches, then drug it out. And that concludes all of the deleted footage that Ben accidentally deleted. And to be honest, he is very good at his job. <laughs> so <laughs> it was it was a mistake. Yeah, but you never make that mistake. Like just once. Just just once. <laughs> it's still gonna be a good video. <laughs> right? <laughs> okay, so now that we got the tree by our little log pile, our little log pile here. I'm going to cut the rest of the branches off and Ben can take it back. <laughs> so there's all the branches. Let's cut them off. those branches cut and cleaned up some of my carvings and some of them have their faces done I still have to do the eagles they're not completely done yet but the bears are done and they're so cute I just love how they turned out look how cute this guy is I just love his little face I said it like three times already but I definitely need to make more of him because he's just so cute I like keeping the base natural too because I may, I think it like makes him pop out more. And then same for this guy. I think just cleaning up around him just makes him really pop in his cute little face and his eyes. But I'm still working on these guys. They're almost done. I love my bears. I don't think I've ever really had like bad days with my bears. Bears are just like my specialty. Um, and that's something that like a lot of carvers have to learn. There's Ben getting the hay. 
That four wheeler is so handy. It has like a winch on it, so we've been able to pull roots and stuff out of it. But anyway, back to my carvings. I really like my bears. Um, bears are just one of those things that like all carvers kind of learn. Don't know why bears are like the number one thing. It's kind of weird. I never really understood it or really know the reason why. Um, they're just really popular. So I had to really make sure that my bears were like good. I really wanted to focus and make my bears really cute and have my own signature. And I think I found it and I've been sticking with it and I love them so much. Um, my eagles on the other hand is something that I need to keep practicing obviously because um, these guys are definitely, they're cute. They're a little wonky but they're cute. This is what I use for a sealer. It's indoor, outdoor, uh, minwax and I like getting the satin and I put a, a couple coats on them so they're all nice and crisp but Mr. Octopus Inky here has been watching me the whole time and just chilling. He has multiple coats on him. That's why he's super shiny and I use like a semi-gloss for him. So there's like three coats on um, the on Inky himself and then there's like two coats of a, of a satin and a semi-gloss and he's just semi-gloss. So that's why he's super glossy. This. Gotta cut this. It is very dry. It's so dry. This is like the driest I've ever seen. Why is that so hard to? Ah, oh, that was our internet cable. <laughs> Nothing like New Zealand calf livers. What? Oh. Alright, so we just start. You can chicken. We don't have chicken. Sorry, don't. I'm with you. No, you can go wherever. Okay. Yeah, that'll be good. The wind is taking all of it. I know, that's why. I started further back. I just threw most of that in my shoe. We're putting hay down! It's exciting! And the sunset is beautiful. The sun's nice and red. We're trying to get this done before it goes down. I don't know. Do you think we can do it before the sun goes down? We're trying. <laughs> it looks like you're playing an instrument. <laughs> I'm trying to get it even. Otherwise, they come in big clumps. I think it's going good. I'm excited. I'm excited to see if it will grow. <laughs> but we're just gonna have hay forever because <laughs> it's never gonna rain. That's why we have the sprinkler running. Yeah. My nose is starting to itch. Oh yeah, mine too. And run. I'm actually doing work. I'm not just. Bam! Bless you! Bam! Bless you. Ben's done most of this. Bam! Bless you! Right there, right there! The sun's almost down! We gotta put the camera down! Somewhere in this mess. Hopefully I don't step on a snake or something. Aw, look how nice he got it all up.